The uh, General Services Administration says President-elect Trump must fully divest his ownership in the Trump International Hotel in Washington to avoid a conflict of interest. That's according to House Democrats. The GSA gave its response to the House Oversight Committee in response to a request. The panel says the Trump team has not yet had any communication with the GSA about that hotel and that it raises serious questions about how he plans to proceed. They're calling this an imminent breach that'll take place on January 20th and that their primary point of contact has been Ivanka Trump. Well, I, geez, these are real estate properties. They're not, you, you can't turn on the dime. I, I thought Andrew Ross Sorkin had a great idea to, uh, to give Ken Feinberg, a, you know, the, the master judge. Ken things. Feinberg, right. A, a little bit of an interim. I, you know, you can't just, these aren't stocks. You can't just say, listen, could you just go buy that for me? I mean, these are very complicated properties. It's an interesting ruling, but there's a lot of rear guard action happening in yep. Trump right now. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.